Good morning, everyone. Welcome to my channel. We're hanging out this morning. We're not going to go down the slip and slide. See, this is the slip and slide. That's right. We take the we take the easy way down. We take the grass. Yes, yes. So, thank you, 151 best friends. 151. Can you believe that? I can't believe it, but it's true. It's so true. The numbers say so. And uh, if you haven't done so, please hit subscribe. I would greatly appreciate that. We're on the journey to 1,000 subscribers because I think I'm going to build a house. You guys, I think I'm going to build a house. I, uh, I think I'm going to build a house. I'm going to build a new house for the pecans. I'm going to build a new house for me. And my yard beasts, my my hounders. And I think I'm gonna build a house. That's the uh, that's the that's the breaking news. <laughs> it just hit me. No, I it, it's been that's part of the part of the uh, of the exciting news that's coming. There's there's going to be a, a colony. It's huge. It's huge, you guys. It's gigantic. So yeah, that's just a little. Well, gracious sakes, just a little preview is I think I'm going to build a house. I'm, pre I'm pretty sure I'm going to build a house. So, in the future, in, in the very near future, probably within the next week or week and a half, I will be revealing the location for said house build. Like, I'm not kidding. Like, this is, this is no, this is not a false alarm. This is not a test. It's not a drill. I really think I'm going to do it. <clears throat> so, I'm going to bring you guys with me, if you don't mind. If you guys will come, I'm, I'm going to bring y'all with me, and y'all can watch the... Y'all, y'all, y'all. Y'all can watch the, uh, watch the madness unfold. So, back to chickens. So, yesterday, I... If you notice, I have a bundle of chicken wire over there, and I have some chicken wire strewn haphazardly over here. I, um, created a little, like, like, snack bar area. <laughs> for the chickens so that they could uh so that they could have some food but i'll show you what they did you can see the favorils are running out of grass so i'm probably going to move them here real soon <clears throat> because these chickens if you leave them in one place too long they wreak havoc on grass so yeah little birdies i know my crows were back this morning i saw two of them down here eating on this pile of gross but, um, <clears throat> I had the, I had their, <coughs> excuse me, I had their wire <clears throat> stapled to this, and then I had it come out, like, around here, and then it went over, and I stapled it to that corner, and they, so they had this whole grassy area, and you see, they didn't do too bad with the green, green grass, but over here... Like, this is now a divot. That is a divot. You can't see it from up there, but you can kind of get a lay of the land. They kind of destroyed things. They they pulled up my wire, this right here. They're, that's not supposed to be like that. All of my little yard staples broke. All of my new grass got ravaged. I knew this would happen. This is no surprise here. I'm not shocked. I knew it would happen. It's not as bad as I thought it would be, quite honestly. I figured they'd have more grass pulled out than that. They really focused on this area where the run was, though. I guess maybe there's, like, a lot of bugs there because of all the chicken poo that was there. So they, they were really, uh, really enjoying that. And they're still creating their moat, which, you know, good job, guys. I did find, I found two pieces of glass in the enclosure. Not just one, but two. Um, after further inspection, I think one of them was a piece of plexiglass, like out of a camper window or something maybe, but, uh, that one piece was definitely a, a very sharp, large shard. It was a, it was a shiv. Um, the inmates are restless <laughs> and they're, they are, uh, they're creating shivs now. No, it was just a piece of glass. Um, yeah, I'm a little nutty, but I'm not that crazy. So let's go in and check and see how the buttons are doing. I'll take you guys along with me. 
if you don't, again, if you don't mind. I left the key in the lock. That's so convenient when I do that. I came down here last night to lock this door because I, uh, as you, I know I didn't do an evening edition, but, um, I, uh, I came in here to lock, I came down here to lock this door and I, I shown my flashlight in here and the buttons were all curled up in their little basket. It was so cute. I was like, oh, you guys are all curled up. Your little basket. I see you sticking your little cute little face out, baby quail. They're not babies anymore, guys. I keep calling them babies because they're so tiny, but they're not babies anymore. I doubt we have any eggs this morning. They usually lay later in the day. Let's see what we can come up with here. What's up? Oh, what? Early morning egg lay? What? What? Two, you guys. We only got five yesterday, so that would make sense. Goodness, that one's still a little moist. Was that you, laddie? Did you lay that egg? That's a faker. That's nothing, and that's nothing. They're really favoring this box. The middle, the top middle box seems to be everyone's favorite. That's laddie, and then I do believe that's Fifi. Yeah, that's Fifi. Fifi's got the messed up comb, the comb on the top of her head is floppy, as you can see. That's Fifi. <coughs> Man. <coughs> Ugh, this weather up here kills me, guys. I'm so sorry. That's so nasty. Sorry for the... <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, the weather's killing me. Oh, my little basket's out here. So I got to do my first egg delivery yesterday to my daddy. He was out of eggs, so I took him eight. So thank you, girls, for taking care of me and my family. I greatly appreciate it. You guys are wonderful just wonderful I don't know if I'm gonna let them roam today or not I was thinking about putting them on the other side like over there between the the fence and our our sheds and stuff but I don't know if I'm gonna do that or I don't know if I'm gonna do it or not it's hard to say hard to say I might do know I just do know so um yeah I'm really excited about this this house build thing again um, that's just part of the news um, the location is what's really really cool the location is freaking amazing you guys you have no idea wait till you see it you're gonna love it it's amazing it's um, <clears throat> it's everything I could have hoped for and more oh that's right and more see and and you know that's uh I, I just, I probably shouldn't say anything else about it. We'll just stop there. <laughs> so yeah, thanks everybody for uh, for tuning in. Surely, surely do appreciate it. Um, again, hit subscribe if you haven't done so already. We're on the march to a thousand subscribers because that is how we get monetized. And it takes a lot of money to build a house. And that is my future endeavor. Um, you know, it's free for you guys. All you have to do is hit the button. And, uh, you know, the magic of technology does all the rest. So, um, if you please let me know where you're from. I love the comments, you guys. I just love it, love it. I love hearing from everyone and seeing where everyone's from and getting feedback on uh, these crazy chickens and life in general. So, give me some of your, your deepest thoughts by Jack Handy please. All right, guys. Happy Thursday. I hope you're having a good day. We're almost there. We're almost to the weekend. Oh, man. Got a piece of him. Did you see that? Oh, man. Oh, gracious. And he eats the feathers of his enemies. Apparently, they all do. That's kind of creepy. Brother, you need, to get, you need to be faster than that. Yeah, you need to lay off the ladies. I see you over there. He might look he might look portly and slow, but he's not. <laughs> All right, everyone. Uh, again, I have a I have an alternate home for the roosters if one of them gets injured. So they're either going to work it out or one of them's going bye bye. So I won't let any blood or injury come to them. But uh, you'll have that. All right, guys. Have a good one. Bye.